everybody. How y'all doing? I'm coming to y'all with a collab from Mother T Speaks. Mama T Speaks. Um, you know, we're doing a collab. Um, Mama T Speaks, Mother's Love. You can hashtag her. Mama T Speaks, Mother's Love. Uh, we love y'all. God bless y'all. Let me start off with prayer, and I'll let y'all know what we're doing. The topic is about mother's love. You know, the experience you had with your mother, what your mother done for you, what are your memories, or what are your, you know, your good times with your mother now. But we're going to let us pray. Oh, first of all, welcome to Praying Couples Cooking Series. And we are the Doolies, Miss Bling. DJ Vince is not here right now. I did just something special for the mothers. Okay, Father God, in the powerful name of Jesus, we thank you for waking us up this morning. We thank you for all you're doing and getting ready to do, Father God. We lift you up, Father God, and we pray for all the mothers that's resting in peace, Father God. You got your wonderful angels all around them, and we just want to tell you, thank you, Father. Thank you, Father God, for blessing with our family, our kids, our grandkids, everybody. Father God, we lifting you up and we thanking you. We surrender, we surrender to you for all our seen and unseen sin. Forgive us of our sin. It is so it is written in your word that we trust and believe in you and let you lead the way and let your will be done. We are blessed. So I thank you for everybody on here. They are blessed. And we lift you up and we magnify you. It is so in Jesus' name. Amen to the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. How's everybody doing? How y'all doing? It's so good to be here with everybody. Um, first of all, these skins right here, because green is my mother's favorite color. My mama's favorite color was green because she loved money. I don't care. If it was a dollar, two, or whatever, she she was not um, you know, she was not have maintenance like that. You give her a dollar, she's happy. But anyway, some stories about my mom. Her name, my mother's name, was Rosemary Allen. She was born March twenty third, nineteen forty five. She passed away in two thousand and eight on Valentine's Day, February fourteenth, two thousand and eight. First of all, I love my mama dearly, and I did give my mother her flowers while she was living. I gave her, she had flowers. We gave her a meal every week. I mean, every week, me and uh, my sisters, my brother, we was all over there. We gave her a meal, her uh, favorite foods. She loved chicken breasts. She loved her some fried chicken breasts, some fish, all that good goodies. She loved it. Uh, I mean, my mother, she was the type of person that she loved all her kids. But she used to always tell me, come here, my eyes. She called me my eyes because, you know, I got big eyes. But, yeah, she said, come here, my eyes, and don't let her get mad at me. She'll call me Louise. Louise, I know I'm in trouble then when she said Louise. Because, uh, you know, it was just different names she had for her kids and what have you. Uh, everybody called me Miss Bling Bling. That's my nickname. But my real name is Barbara Louise Dooling. But my mama get mad and she'll call me Louise. But y'all keep on saying Miss Bling Bling. I like it better. But anyway, my mother was so loving and kind. And she did her best to take care of her kids. Uh, my father got killed in a train wreck when I was eight years old. The ones that have been following me, they know that. If not, y'all can go back and watch the playlist. I got it on the playlist. My father uh, got killed by a train wreck. I was eight years old. I used to sit on the curb. And uh, my mama always wondered where I'm at. And she'll tell him she brought it down on that curve. So I would pray to the Lord. I said, Lord, if you bless me to get rich, I help everybody in the world. He blessed me to be rich in heart. That's more than money. He blessed me to be rich in heart. So that's the reason I give and do what I do. Everything I do, I don't do it to be seen. I was a little bitty girl, eight years old on the curve. Asking God to bless me to bless people. So I don't do it to be seen. I do it from my heart. And then when people see it, it makes them and motivates them. It inspires them to help people. So I want to get that clear. What we do, we do for my heart, my husband and I. But back to my mama. The reason I say it there because my mama used to come home and say, she worked at, uh, uh, we stayed in East Memphis, in Memphis, Tennessee, in East Memphis, off of Mendenhall uh, on Wilburn Street. But she used to work at this pancake shop on Mendenhall. And every time she'd get out of work, she used to always tell me before she'd go to work, uh, what you doing now? You up to something. When I come home, I'll be not, don't you get my whole house away. When I come home, I won't have nothing. <laughs> so I want to think about the fun time. I don't want to cry about it. I want to think about the fun time to lift her up, to lift me up so my spirit won't be so down. And all the other mothers out here, the ones that's in heaven, here's your flowers from Miss B Miss Bling Bling. Here's your flowers. You know, y'all just 
take these flowers and they they going up to heaven. Up to heaven to all the beautiful mothers. All the beautiful mothers. But anyway, back to my mother. She loved chicken breast. She loved us of chicken breast. And uh, she loved cologne. I couldn't stay out of cologne for none. She loved to keep her cologne. She do love to smell good. She did love to smell good. And uh, when I was doing Avon back then, I used to try to give my mama some cologne, but she would always pay for it. She said, this is a business, so I need to pay for it. My mama loved to drink. She loved to drink. When she left here, I think she was drinking. You know why? Because my mama said she was already in pain and uncomfortable. Why not have a drink and just continue to enjoy her life? I never tried to stop her from drinking. I used to go a million miles to get my mama whatever she wanted. Me and my husband be way in Tunica somewhere. My mama called me and said she wanted anything. I was there. Uh, I'm not perfect, but I, I think I accidentally cursed in front of my mama one time. Cursed accidentally. And I said, oh, mama, forgive me. But I never cursed in front of my mama. I never disrespect my mama. If I say something like, oh, mama, you don't need that or you don't need this, and then I feel bad from that. Because, you know, you got to honor that mother and father. My father, like I said, got killed when I was eight years old. A uh, train wreck. My Uncle Johnny made it. Thank God he made it. My Uncle Johnny. I love all my uncles. Uncle Duga, all of them. I love all of them. They took us in when my father passed away when I was eight years old. Then my mama had five kids taking care of all of us by herself. So my mom was a beautiful person. She did what she could for everybody. I mean, my mom would curse you out and tell you off in a split second. And that's how I used to be. I, I, I never had a attitude, but I had a quick temper when you mess with me. And I thank God for transformation. I don't have no quick temper no more. I'm just as humble and loving as I am. I want to be. My mama taught me that. Keep them lips closed. Don't run your mouth too much. But still, sometimes I find myself trying to comfort people and talk when I should just listen. Because I feel like if I say the wrong thing, it'll make them feel a certain way about me. But you can't worry about what people think and feel about you. Because they're going to think and feel about you that's how they are. They show you who they are from the get-go. So when people be envious and jealous or got mean spirit, you know, that's when the good Lord don't like corruptedness. He don't like the word being all evil, mean, and wicked and stuff. We got to live and be right. But anyway, long story short, I'm not going to hold this video. My mom used to always tell me, you're going to be one of my special children. you always giving. you always trying to bless people. You all, And then I, my mama was spotless. She said, I always keep your private clean. Always keep your hygiene up and always look your best because you're just as good as the rest. My mom always told us never be jealous of nobody because you're just as good as the next person. So I want everybody to know you just as good as the next person. Your mama, if, your, if my mama told me that and, uh, and I know she meant it from her heart, don't ever be envious or jealous of nobody. And then I don't sing a real good, but I'm going to do a, look, a few verses of a song, my mama's song. And she also taught me Psalm 23. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me beside the still waters. He restores my soul. He leadeth me in path of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For thou I will meet that rod, that staff, they will come for me. They will prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemy. Thou will anoint my head with oil, my cup runs over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. On the Sunday morning, somebody touched me. On the Sunday morning, somebody touched me. It must have been the hands of the Lord. Feel the fire burning, somebody touch me. Feel the fire burning, somebody touch me. It must have been the hands of the Lord. That's all I can say, y'all. I'm not a singer, but I try my best. But anyway, that's about my mom. She was sweet. She was loving. She didn't play. She didn't take no mess. And she would dress her best. Um, I wanted to put a picture on here of my mom, but I didn't get a chance to. I make it find a picture of my mom. Y'all hold tight one second. Okay, everybody, I hope you can see. This is a picture of my mother. I hope you can see. That's my mother and my brother. The sun kind of beaming a little bit on it. But this is a picture of my mom. She, it was on New Year's at Club Bling Bling. That's when I earned that name, Miss Bling Bling. Yeah, this is a picture of my mom right here. It's my beautiful mother. I hope y'all enjoyed this. Everybody just please uh, hop along and do it. Uh, mother T speaks. Mother T Speaks came up with this collab. Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers. We love y'all. God bless y'all. Please hashtag, hashtag her. Mother T Speaks, Mother's Love. We love y'all. God bless y'all. 
into the next end. Do all you can, while you can. We all were born to win. God bless.